message from Pastor Watson. Metropolitan, I cannot thank you enough for participating in our 2016 Gifts from the Heart campaign. Matthew 25, 41 says, And as much as you did it to one of the least of these, my brethren, you did it to me. There are so many families who do not have the resources to purchase clothes and toys for their children during the Christmas season. Your incredible act of selfless giving ensures that a child in our church and or community wakes up with a smile on Christmas morning. I have said this before, but my dear Metropolitan, you continue to stand strong and you personify faith in action. No pastor is more grateful than I to lead a congregation so loving and committed to the cause of Christ. May the peace and joy of Jesus be with you. It's that time of year again. Please bring canned and dried goods for Supper Bowl Sunday from now through February 5th. Donations will be distributed to local food banks. For more information, contact Reverend Michael Thomas or Cecilia Walker from the Street Ministry. Child abuse prevention classes are required of all who work with our youth. Mark your calendars now for the 2017 Child Abuse Prevention Initiative Series. This year's offerings include non-aggressive behavior modification, systemic effects of child abuse, and introduction to CAPI. Registration is required. Please register in the church office after each service or online at metropolitanbaptist.org. Join us for worship on January 15th as the Largo High School Choir, under the direction of Brandon J. Felder, will join our Metropolitan youth in worship. Talented young people, if you sing, dance, step, or play an instrument, we need you to use your gifts for a powerful youth explosion on that day. Come one and come all. For more information, see Brother Reggie Golden or Sister Barbara Harrison. The Metropolitan Historical Book is available for pickup and sale following each worship service. Don't miss this opportunity to get a copy of this history book that captures Metropolitan's first 150 years of service and ministries, trials and triumphs. The Bereavement Ministry invites you to a time to remember as we honor persons who have crossed over to receive their eternal reward. Join us on Saturday, January 7th at 10 a.m. here in the sanctuary. We are one body. The women's ministry, We Are One Body, will distribute food on Sunday, January 8th after the 9.30 and 11.30 a.m. worship services. The We Are One Body table is Metropolitan's way of answering God's call for us to help one another. If you would like to donate, Please bring small or medium non-perishable items to add to our table. Metropolitan will begin having arts and worship services on the fifth Sundays at the 11.30 a.m. worship services. During these services, the glory of the Lord shall fill this temple as we offer up spiritual sacrifices through the arts. Please join us and invite friends and family to experience the power of the arts and faith together. On January 29th, we will feature joyful sound, resounding praise, spoken word, a sign language choir, and our very own saxophonist, Todd Ledbetter. <laughs>